guys, welcome back to Man Stuff TV. Um, here's a little one for you today. I've been having a play around with new guy lines. I've made some new guy lines up and I've attached these on. Now, the cordage I'm using is extremely thin. It's uh, 1.3 mil. So you can see by the size of my thumb to the size of that, you know, it is tiny stuff and it's quite slippery. Um, so yeah, so I've made up, I made up four guy lines. This was to go on the Sargasso top. What I've done is I've put clips on, on each one, these little, little clips. And then Steve, Sparky Steve, very kindly sent me five of these. So I put them on. And then I tried them out on the tarp, which is up, and they have a very sharp burr on the inside. So if you've got needle files or something like that, you can file that out, but you can just about see that in there, that, that little burr. Yeah, that cut the end of the, uh, of the cordage. So that pissed me off a little bit, but hey ho, shit happens. And I thought to myself, well, how am I going to do this then? Uh, I need a way of, I need a way to tension the cord. How am I going to do it? Well, I come up with an idea. It's very simple. What you do is you don't bother with them whatsoever. Completely scrap them. Just have hook either end and do that. So that bit's wrapped around your tree or around your peg or through the um, through the tie out on your tarp or the eyelet on your tarp or something. All right, that goes around there. It comes back on itself and then all you do is you clip it on twice. Yeah, you just pass it through twice. Hang on, I'll show you exactly what I mean. All right, so you pass that round whatever or, or you pass that through and you know, and then, what you do is, oh, can you see? Right, there we go. And then you go, clip it on once, go around and clip it on again. That's all you do. So, as long as there's tension, it's not gonna move. But, you can always move it. Whatever you want. You see? slips through no problem so screw all these little kind of things and you get the little plastic ones that are flat so sod them all off don't need them and if you if you do that on both ends you've got twice as much adjustment so anyway there you go little tip from me uh, have a nice day, guys. Bye-bye.